Welcome to week number two for Claire. My name is Jodie Bunting and this is our six-week course where our slimmers are going to be losing a stone in six weeks. Hi Claire. Hey. How you doing? I'm not too bad, thank you. So we've stayed the same this week. Yes. And um, why do you think that might be? Um, obviously, I'm still not exercising because of my bad knee. Yeah. Um, I've, I have picked up my walking a little bit because my knee isn't hurting as much. So I'm trying not to rush into it and go back a bit by rushing into it too early. Yeah. So I'm just trying to be careful with that. Um, but I've been counting calories, so I'm a little bit disappointed this week. Um, if anything, I've done better this week than last week, and I lost two pounds last week. So, <laughs> yeah, it's one of them. And how do you feel? Um, just obviously a bit disappointed with the result, um, but good in myself because I've been eating fairly well, to be fair. Yeah. Um, and. I've obviously been recording my alcohol. Um, so, so yes, yeah, so I, don't, I don't really know what I'm doing wrong. Right, let's have a little look through your food diary then and we'll see if there's anything there that we can try and improve. Yeah. Um, right, Monday, which is today. So you've had the summer fruit with Greek yogurt this morning with a little bit of granola, uh, a banana and some eggs. Oh, sorry, this is lunch. I wondered where that was going then. <laughs> I, was, I was reading out your breakfast. So this was yeah. kind of, was it two meals or did you have it as one? Um, no, it was one. It's was that this? Was that it? today? No, I think that was last week, wasn't it? Are you looking at last Monday or this Monday, today? This is today. This is today. Have you had pancakes for lunch or not? No. Okay, maybe it's on the wrong day then. Let's go to yesterday. <laughs> yeah, go to yesterday. <laughs> um, Sunday, uh, yesterday, you had uh, the Greek yogurt with the summer fruits and granola. Um, for dinner, it was risotto, about chicken risotto. No, have you got, are you looking at the wrong Claire? Could that this be it? I don't know. You're really confusing me now. <laughs> I think it's me, Claire. It really... It's Monday. It's Monday. Right, here we go. Let's start again. <laughs> right, for breakfast, you had sausage, eggs and mushrooms. Yes, that's me, <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh, for lunch, you did have Greek yogurt and fresh raspberries. Yes, that's it. Wow. So this is great. So this is nice, clean day you're having so far. What are you planning on having for your tea? Um, I'm thinking of having mackerel, um, smoked mackerel with a little bit of a salad. But I don't know whether to have some scrambled egg with that or... I'm not sure yet. I'm, un I'm unsure, but I, I will definitely have smoked mackerel. I'm not sure yet what with. <laughs> Perfect. Right. Now, yesterday uh, was sausage, egg and mushroom for lunch. Uh, in the evening, uh, beef burger and fries. Was that at home? That was out. That was my... Um, Your little treat day yesterday. Pub. Yeah, that was my pub tea last night. And because it was so hot and sunny, you had a couple of ice creams as well. Yes. Great. It was a two scoop ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> right. Saturday is one medium banana for breakfast. Yeah. Um, and then a tuna and cucumber roll for lunch with a bit of popcorn and a glass yeah. of white wine. Yeah. In the evening, salad with feta cheese and fish cakes and some olives. Yeah. And then in the snack section, we've got some just five gummy bears, just five. <laughs> a bit of carver. 
some yes. crackers and some soft cheese. Yeah. I love the way you're tracking everything, Claire. This is great. I know. <laughs> uh, Friday, a banana again for breakfast. Uh, for lunch, a salami sandwich with a strawberry mousse. Yes. And a satsuma. In the evening, the one of my favourites, the Slimwell um, by Aldi Chicken Sarg with yes. some tortilla, a bit of Jack Daniels. Was that in the yes. curry or was that No, out? not in the curry, no. <laughs> that was a little bit later in the evening. <laughs> Never tried that one. And a bit of white wine as well. Yeah. Um, and then a cup of soup as well thrown in there as well. Um, let's have a look. Thursday. Scrambled eggs for breakfast with some mackerel. Fab. Yeah. How do you how did you feel on that day having that scrambled egg and mackerel versus just the banana? Um, I was a lot more full for a lot longer. Yeah. Um, but I think sometimes when I know when I'm having a quite a big dinner at tea time, I try and eat light at the start of the day when if I'm not going to be having such a big meal in the evening, then I normally have a really good breakfast. Yeah. If you know what I mean. <laughs> and when you've had just the banana, are you feeling more hungry or not? Or is it not really affecting you? Um, Not really. I can cope. Like if I'm busy and I'm keeping busy, I don't really notice. And then all of a sudden it's lunch anyway. Yeah. So then I can have my lunch, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, but when I'm working from home, I try to have a really good breakfast, which then will last me, and then I can just have satsumas, or I can just have, like, yoghurt um, yeah. and whatnot for lunch, and then, then look forward to a nice meal in the evening. So on that Thursday, you had just the yoghurt and the uh, raspberries for lunch. And yeah. then the evening, you had chicken thighs, kidney beans, uh, some rice and a Freddo, little Freddo. Yeah. And then in the snack section was a banana, rivita and a little bit of soft cheese. Yeah. Um, Wednesday was celery and hummus for breakfast. Oh, get you. <laughs> I love celery and hummus. I do. Yeah, I do. Uh, for lunch, a chicken wrap and satsumas. Uh, in the evening, some gammon steak, egg, mushy peas, um, a little bit of vodka and lemonade, uh, some oven chips and a banana. And then last Tuesday was the protein shake with the almond milk for breakfast. Uh, yes. The protein oats, or sorry, golden syrup oats. Oh, yeah, golden syrup protein oats for lunch uh, with some smoky bacon crisp. That's a weird combination, Claire. <laughs> <laughs> Orange and some crisp. That was your dinner. <laughs> Did you just fancy that or something? Um, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Tell me you didn't dip them in it. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> that would be wrong. <laughs> And then for dinner, uh, spaghetti bolognese uh, and then a strawberry mousse, uh, satsuma and banana um, and um, a cereal bar. Great. Right. So what I would like you to do is try to, what do you think about increasing the size of your meals and cutting down the snacks? Yeah. Okay. I can do that. So what I want you to, to mainly focus on is just to have tr more protein in your meals. Yeah. And this will help you stop snacking as well. Um, I know you said because you're not exercising, you're not feeling as hungry like you were. But I just think the little tweak that I'd like to make is just to make the meals a little bit bigger and then take away some of the snacks. Because um, although things like satsumas and bananas are healthy, they are still quite high in sugar as well. So just lowering your sugar intake and upping your protein intake should give you the weight loss that we want. Okay. What do you think to that? Yep, I will. I'll do that. And you've tracked yep. absolutely everything, haven't you? Even your treats on the yeah. Sunday. 
So yeah, again, yeah. This, this is where it's really annoying because if you do the math, she should have definitely lost one or two this week. Yeah. And I'm sure my fitness pal has been telling you that all week, hasn't it? That in five weeks, she will weigh so much like it does. Yeah. That's why it's so annoying because I am putting everything in there. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I think I'll just carry on as I'm doing. Try and not get too disheartened by it. But last week yeah. is last week. This week is now this week. I'll, I'll just do like what you say. Cut down on my bits of fruit and bits and bobs of what my snacking, cereal bars, try and get rid of those um, and try and just stick to three meals. Yeah. Um, and within my calories. So I'll give that a try. And if you don't feel like having a big meal, then have that yeah. cereal bar and your piece of fruit as the actual meal. You know, like the day when you had the yogurt and the, the raspberries. So, yeah, yeah. If, you, if you have a big breakfast and you feel like a small meal, then that's fine. Just try not to have the snacks at any other time. Try and stick to three meals. Does that sound yeah. doable? Yes. Yeah, it does. Great. How's your digestive system? Um, OK. And how's yeah. your sleep been this week? Um, sleep, I've probably not had as much sleep as usual um just with one thing and another yeah um but i do normally get sort of between six and seven hours sleep a day or, or a night should i say yeah um so it's not terrible um what finally what is your goal for next week claire um well seeing as i've not lost i'd like to lose three pound really to try and make up for nothing this week yeah well, i think so, just as i said just just trying to cut the sugar down and up in the protein will definitely give you a big loss but calorie wise do exactly the same just stay within your calories it doesn't matter if you go over a bit or under a bit um that that's going to get you your goal for next week okay does that sound okay yeah that sounds good <laughs> and as always water 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 keep on getting in as much as you can Yes, I don't actually track that. So yeah, that's maybe fine. I, I Just generally, if you, how much do you think you're having? Um, well, I don't drink a lot of fizzy pop anyway. When I'm at home, I've got like um, a filtered tap. So it's all filtered straight from the tap. So yeah, myself, my, my daughters, we always have sort of squash um, or just normal water with ice. So we do drink, I would thought, quite a lot, really. I must get through about five or six glasses every day. Great. So, so again, just so try and up that to eight if you can. Okay. So a couple more glasses as well, and that will just guarantee everything. Yeah. Great. Right, any okay. other questions? Um, no, no, that's fine. Fab. Right, well, message me at any point, Claire, and I'll see you next week. Brilliant. Okay. Bye, Jodie. Thank you. Bye. Bye.